Hey Virgo, what's up? So we are going to be looking into who is coming towards you within the month of September. This is a general reading and it's also more targeted towards love. So make sure you check out your gym or what your Venus sign as well. Um, if you would like a personal reading, all of that information will be in the description box below. I've already started shuffling your cards. We're just going to get right into it. We got the Nine of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands in reverse. We got the Three of Swords and the Seven of Cups. Oh, Lord. We got the Will of Fortune and the Five of Cups in reverse. And we got the King of Cups in the World card, okay? Um... <clears throat> Virgo, you got a person coming towards you who's always cared about their well-being and their self-sufficiency, okay? They put what is going to benefit them before anybody else, including you, because you done got hurt by this person. This person hurt you within them doing what they felt like was best for them or what was going to be more beneficial for them, Okay. This is a very selfish person. And it's not even a selfish person in the sense of like someone who is like, okay, well, we got to part ways because I need to work on myself. I need to better myself. I need to give myself the time and focus that I, that I need right now. This is a person that's going around drinking, smoking, talking to all of the peoples of the lands that got the private part that they like. And just all these short-term fulfillments is what I'm getting, okay? This is a person who runs, who is fueled by short-term pleasures and fulfillments of life. Um, and although this person may have been very fun, very pleasing to you in some way, because you dealt with them, Virgo. You dealt with them. They coming back, okay? So this is somebody that you dealt with already, um, this is someone who puts theirs first. Okay, so yeah, you got stung in the crossfires. What's this Ace of Wands in reverse, please? And thank you. One more time. We got the Ten of Swords in reverse. Mm. And we got the hangman in reverse. Hmm. No. Not right now, babe. Um. I feel like now this person is coming in with the energy where they have been. How do I put this? I feel like they're coming back in. Okay. Nine. I feel like they're coming back in like just trying to see if they can put certain things aside that may be hurtful to you that benefits them in whatever way that it does. But I don't feel like this is something like where they've completely stopped doing it. I feel like they're still in the testing stages. And what I mean by that is if this is someone who was cheating on you because they found pleasure in it, despite knowing that it could hurt you, I feel like now they are trying to come in with the energy of, I'm gonna be faithful so that I can try to not hurt this person because I know I've hurt them before, that sort of thing. But it doesn't feel like they're stopping just because they need to stop. They're stopping because they done got a STDs. They're not stopping because they feel like that's the best thing for them. I feel like they're stopping and trying to regain you back. Okay. Um, so I don't know. I don't know how that's going to work. Um, work out here. We're we going to see. Um, and we got the high priestess in reverse. So, I, you know what, Virgo? I feel like this person has you all tied up and confused and just 
like you second quick look nine of swords you were so stressed out you were so confused this person would say one thing the actions would show another you didn't actually get proof of things and when you did it kind of had that gray like gray area type of energy where it's not like flat out 100% like this is an 80% thing you know you done seen a text message but he's saying that's his cousin and you can't really prove it but you know in your gut it was like that okay this this is this is a lot okay but this person had you all confused okay they knew what to say um and and all of that okay but you knew, deep down, you knew, okay? What's this Wheel of Fortune here with the Five of Cups in reverse, please? One clarifier. We got the Judgment card in reverse. We have Cancer here. I forget what the Judgment card is. The Wheel of Fortune is all the fixed signs. Um... Yeah, I'm not even gonna try to guess on the judgment because I don't. I, I just... We also have a lot of water because we get Cancer, Pisces, uh, Scorpio. I feel like this person wants to to make things right, like they want to right their wrongs. We have the Ten of Cups. Um, so I feel like this person does want to be with you. I feel like they feel bad that them wanting to do what they wanted to do affected you. But honestly, I feel like this person like wishes that they could have done what they would have done or could have done what they were doing and you not find out about it. And they're able to be with you and be pleased within that and still do what they want to do on an individual basis and still be pleased by that. So just keep that in mind. Again, and it is showing that this person does like want to fix their wrongs. Like, I just feel like, in my opinion, I feel like they're doing it from the wrong place. They're not doing it from a place of actually wanting not to do it because them wanting to do it got them in the situation they were in. So to stop doing something just because of something else or someone else, that doesn't tend to really stick within becoming a habit, if you get what I mean. Um, but yeah, I feel like their intentions are to come in and to right their wrongs and to have a family with you and just fix things. Um, now in the potential, we got the world card and the king of cups. So we gonna look into that. What's this world card with the king of cups, please? One clarify. We got the eight of cups in reverse. So what's the world card about? We have the two of pentacles in reverse. One more card, please. One more. The full card in reverse. That's Aquarius. Huh. This energy is a little conflicting here. I feel like, though, this person is going to come in and they are going to show their love to you i feel like um whether this person cheats again or not because i'm not 100 percent sure i feel like this all coming to a light and how it affected you i feel like it did have an effect on them and i feel like they do realize um how much they love you and how much they do want you to be in their lives however I feel like in order for this person to change, because again, I don't feel like this person, but then you guys stopped talking, made this change. I feel like this is a new change based on the decision of wanting you back. So it's still fresh. So I feel like they won't be able to fully just jump into what they need to be for you right away, whether you decide to move forward or not. But I do see some sort of new cycle happening here with the world card, whether it's ultimately you leave this person alone or you know you guys go on to a faithful ch chapter in life okay so yeah Virgo I hope that this was helpful and I'll see you on the next one